your girl, The Empress, and welcome back to my channel. For today's video, as you read by the title, this would be a mullet look on a POC, a person of color. I am recording this on Christmas. I was supposed to record it before, but I don't know. I honestly don't know. I haven't been as motivated. I get I was trying to have some Christmas back, uh, background music, but YouTube and they ads. But uh, yeah, I was not really motivated to post on here. We're gonna hop right into the video. As you guys can see, I already did my makeup. So this video shouldn't have a lot of cuts. So um, let's get into it. Okay, so I ended up changing my shirt because I don't know. I'm I'm in the kind of kind of in the Christmassy mode, but I left off. I was just slicking my edges back. Yeah, I just felt the random urge to change my shirt to get into something more comfy. I'm glad I did because I am very comfortable right now. I'm not going to let it completely dry, I do need to stick the cap on, and I like to get like some sticky action like on my edge area, if that makes sense, some sticky action, okay, <laughs> uh, I'm going to use this cap, because it's a bit closer, more, more closer, a bit closer, a bit more, more closer, a clip. It's closer to my skin tone. Oh, I have on the full face of makeup and I'm about to put on a I hate when I don't think things through. Okay. It's gonna make a line. I already know. It's gonna make a line. Okay, so I'm not gonna bring it all the way down to my eyes as I usually would. Simply because I have on a full face of makeup and I don't want to mess it up because not only that Not only is that a waste of my time, but that's a waste of Makeup products and we don't do that around here, okay? Uh, What I'm doing now if I can grip it is just cutting out ear tabs Simple as that. I don't like to drag the scissors when I'm cutting Cause when I do it create like rigid lines up. Okay. I'm spreading it out more so it covers more of my ear on this side. Because this part is a bit up. Okay, I'm gonna do the same for this side. Yeah. See it's fine. Uh now I'm gonna put some spiking glue over the cap. I'm gonna do a thin layer. I do want it to stick, but I don't want it to take too long to dry. Here I go sniffing again. Uh you guys most likely know though. Well some of you know, but I have really bad allergies. <laughs> like outside of sinuses. Well, we're talking about sinuses now, but outside of sinuses, I have really bad allergies. I know people are probably tired of me saying this, but your girl got 36 allergies. I'm, I'm not proud of it, but it's definitely, I would say, in my opinion, very unique to have 36 allergies. And probably more. I had some almonds the other day. It was like a peanut and almond mix. Peanut, almond, cashew, and a walnut mix, I'm, I think. I had that and my skin started breaking. Like, I only had the almonds, of course, because I'm allergic to peanuts. 
uh, I only had the almonds and somehow I ended up breaking out. So I'm pretty sure that it's the, uh, it's the peanut residue that was on the almonds. Cause I'm not allergic to walnuts. I'm not allergic to cashews. So it can't be either of those. I'm going to use a blow dryer today for time purposes and because it's Christmas and I want to get up and I want to do something other than sit in the bathroom. Not that I don't want to sit and talk to you guys, but yeah. switching a lot during the video I apologize it's become a habit I don't know it's just a habit like I'm just, like when I'm sitting here talking to myself you will hear like my true true voice but when I'm looking at the camera and I realize oh I'm on YouTube I gotta speak formal then I code switch back into the I don't want to say white voice but the white voice uh yeah so if you do hear that I apologize yeah. <laughs> I'm using a blow dryer so y'all just gonna have to hear me for a few seconds I didn't want to be I didn't want it to be super quiet or too loud but yeah I'm gonna blow dry this and I'm gonna be right back okay guys so I'm assuming the cap is fully dry there's no stickiness no tackiness so I'm gonna go ahead and lift Ooh, pinch and cut I'm gonna use this comb my nails are pretty short I don't have my nails done for the first time in who knows how long? But, uh, yeah. Usually I would do this with a razor, but I honestly don't feel like looking for it. Uh, so basically all I'm doing right now is cutting off the excess lace. I don't want to say lace. Like, what do you call this? Excess cap? Excess material? We're just gonna say excess for now. This scissor is pretty dull. I doubt this one's gonna be any better. Oh, it actually is. Look at that. Okay. All I know right now is cutting off the ex excess cap. Now I'm gonna move this kind of back some where the first layer, well I think the first layer of track is gonna land. I'm gonna take my got to be glue again. Not got to be, yeah, got to be. And then I'm gonna pin down this extra lace right here so she could be all for real. really excited for this install I don't know about y'all but I'm so excited because I've never well I've seen one person one POC well not one multiple but it's like not a lot of people of color wearing mullets because of the kind of connotation or denotation one of the two that comes behind wearing a mullet but the 2020 mullet the thing behind the 2020 mullet. I think it's I think it's super cute. I actually got this inspiration from playing uh Everskies. It was this hairstyle that was on her that was super bomb. I was actually talking to my best friends about doing this hair. About like getting a wig and just cutting it into a mullet and styling it like the one that's on Ever Skies. I 
Okay, now that I have that partially dried, <laughs> I'm gonna get these little small alcohol pads because I don't know where my actual alcohol is. I'm gonna use these little alcohol pads. I'm gonna wipe away the excess makeup. So when I put the glue down, there's no oil blocking the sticking process, if that makes sense. Hey guys, it's me. Um, I noticed that like this part was over the top long and like unnecessarily long. Like even if I sped it up, it would still been long. So I'm gonna keep y'all company until Dummy here finishes wiping off the excess glue on her forehead. <laughs> she was fat, so it's gonna take a while. But uh, yeah, so we probably gonna sing us uh, some little Christmas carols. Cause it is Christmas. I am recording on Christmas. So uh yeah. Santa baby, hurry down the chimney tonight. Da -da. Da -da. I don't plan on changing my hair every month or every two weeks, every four weeks. That's still a month. Every two weeks or every month, like I usually would. Yeah, no, that's that's too much for quarantine. Okay. Okay, now that I have that all cleaned up. I'm gonna grab shorty over here, y'all. I was super nervous about this unit because uh, she looked choppy, first of all. But it's okay because it's a mullet and that's how it's supposed to look. So I'm gonna cut off this back piece of lace back here. I'm gonna cut that off because we don't need that. I don't ever. Well, I'm not gonna say ever, but I don't usually put my hair into, like I don't glue the back of my hair down. That's what I'm saying. But I'm gonna cut the ear tabs starting from these little sections right here. My nails look crusty, y'all. It's glue and makeup, so don't look at me like I'm crazy. <laughs> I'm gonna cut from the bottom of this little piece. And then I'm gonna cut around. I should move the camera down so y'all should see what, can see what I'm doing. Uh, oh, this is about to be messy. Okay. So now that I have that cut, I'm gonna put her on my head. Let me hook this first. This way, I, I'm so sorry, y'all. I don't know where my mom got it from. Cause like, she be buying them, I don't remember. But it's, I guess, would be considered a 360 wig. It comes in four combs, one in the front, two at the side, one at the bottom, and it also comes with a clip. A clip. We're gonna call it a clip, but uh, I don't usually use the combs because I don't see the purpose. Well, I, mm, when you wearing a cap, I don't see the purpose of wearing a comb. Let me pull this down. Trying to get these little spots to line up on my eyebrows in a way. Okay, I'm gonna cut it in three and I'm gonna glue it down in three. So run right above my eyebrow, a little bit into the lace, a little bit close to the hairline. 
so it's easier to move it out the way. Like so. Now I'm gonna clip these side pieces back. Now I'm gonna go in with my ghost bind glue. Period. I'm gonna pluck it after I lay the lace down, so don't worry about that. I know the hairline's looking really crazy right now, but uh, per. <laughs> okay, okay, I'm gonna look over here. It's easy for me to see. Nope, it's not. That's a slide. I'm gonna do. Ooh, that's a lot. I'm gonna do dots around the perimeter of my head. Then I'm gonna use my comb to blend it out. As I said in my last video, we're gonna spread it like butter. Just flatten it out. We'll spread it, not flatten it out. I'm gonna go back on the cap a little bit, more than a little bit. Yeah, I definitely did put too much for a first layer. I forgot to put my phone on, do not disturb. I was wondering, like, I swore, I could have swore I put my stuff on do not disturb. I'm sitting here like, like I'm noticing in and out. Let me start one more time. I'm noticing, like, I'm not getting no type of notifications. Because nobody talks to me. I don't like people. And the person I actually want to talk to don't want to talk to me, so. <laughs> That's tough. But it's life. It's, it's life, y'all. Okay, so that was just my third layer. Now I'm gonna go in and lay this baby down. I'm so scared, y'all. I don't know what I'm scared for, but Ooh, it's just the excitement of a new wig. like this but I forgot so I'm gonna have to so I'm gonna lift it up and measure like where the tip of my ears stop usually I part this section so I don't get no fuzzies behind my head I'm gonna have to do it this way okay now I'm gonna cut this I'm gonna do a little tick right here I don't know if I should I come closer. I'm gonna do a little tick right here. That's what you do if you forget to cut your tabs. Now when you do that, it should comfortably come over your ear like that. Without you having to cut it again. That's fine. Okay. Without you having to cut it again. Okay. Now I'm gonna get my got to be free spray to get rid of these little white marks. I'm gonna use this scarf and tie it down. We're gonna let it sit for 10 minutes and come back and I'm gonna show you guys the results. It hasn't been 10 minutes, it's been like seven-ish, but I got impatient. So we're just gonna take it off. 
Ooh. Come on, look at that. Y'all can't tell me nothing. <laughs> I don't even know how I'm gonna click this hair back because it's pretty short. Problem solved. I mean, with any business, you run into risk. Because on Ali, there are like some fake vendors out there that will scam you for your money and give you nothing. Give you nothing back. You would be expecting a wig. You never get it. When you go to them, when you ask for it, they say, oh, you have to give a five star review in order to get your money back. Some stupid stuff. But I say just make sure you do in depth research. Okay, so what I'm doing now is I'm before I cut this uh, lace off, I'm gonna go in with my hot comb and I'm gonna brush it all back. How is she already hot? Come on now. I'm gonna leave a link to the products that I'm using in my hair in the description box below. So check it out. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. I always forget to mention that. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, guys. So I can post more content like this. I love that my family has been so supportive of my career. I love that my family has been so supportive of me being on YouTube. And I like I just I, I really appreciate it. When I first thought of like making a channel. Like, I don't have a lot of bonds, bonds with people. So I didn't think I would get, like, as much support. Look, I completely disregard the fact that I have a family. I was overthinking. <gasps> Y'all, I just burned my ear. I'm all, well, I grazed my ear. My life flashed before my eyes. <laughs> Wow, okay, Leone, let's not talk in using iron at the same time. Cause... I'm gonna cut away this extra lace. I'm not gonna cut it in a straight line. I mean, I don't really have a choice. Hold on, y'all. Yeah, I'm not gonna cut it in a straight line. Cause when you cut it in a straight line, like the lace looks way more noticeable. Than if you did like zigzags across the hairline. Oh, I can't see. Where are your glasses, kids? Where are your glasses? Yeah, I'm not gonna add a lot. I'm gonna make sure I spread it out so when I lay it down, it doesn't dry. White! Don't ever cut your lace straight. And there you go. There you go. She's on there, not going anywhere. Okay, so I'm gonna go in with my hot comb. 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 I
so the whiteness, the ashiness, the ashy look doesn't show up as much. So I don't like that. I'm gonna use my hot comb first. And I'm gonna bring this forward. Pretty much most of it is curled. This part goes straight back. These parts go up. This is so sloppy, y'all, but like it's not supposed to be a neat hairstyle. You feel me? It's supposed to be like a messy, cute but messy layered hair. I'm gonna fluff it out. To get this side layer laid, I'm gonna spray it with my messaging spray. And then I'm gonna just. Now, this hair doesn't have edge like an edge look. myself doing the mullet I think it was something like this I'm gonna pull up the reference picture so I can like get it like on there this part the port this part also curves with the bangs This part is tucked. See, I knew something was going on on this side. This whole section is a part of the bang. This part is tucked back here. I'm gonna tuck this piece too. part up here is a bit fluffier so we're gonna try to create a fluffier look okay I'm gonna have to fluff this part up This part right here, do some fluffing. Yo, it's not exact, but we definitely getting somewhere.
I just fell in love with this look and I'm trying to get it exact but y'all I'm struggling if I look stupid somebody please tell me in the comments I look like somebody's mom okay Okay, her bangs are longer than mine, so I don't think I'll be able to get the exact look in the front, but, um, it's close. I'm gonna fuck out the back. So it don't look all thick in the front and thin in the back. Y'all, I think it looks okay. I think it looks okay so far. I don't know, y'all. <laughs> I don't look stupid because she looks so good. She looks so good with it. Okay, I think... The problem is hers is up and over, and mine is just like down. A little. And now hers go down. Okay, hold on. Not me trying to look like a character from an online game. Okay, I gotta fix the back. Then hers go down and kind of like this. Y'all, tell me if it's close. Because I don't know. <laughs> this part isn't back, y'all. Is forward and down like it's like a type thing that's probably what's throwing me off to be honest a bit of a curve give it some volume she has a bad ass right it's like a back curve This out more. I can't get the out part. I don't want to burn my head though. <laughs> I don't want to burn my head. Okay. The differences that we have going on is that 
our hair isn't layered the same. And she's a cartoon character. She's a fictional character. But the hair is very much real. <laughs> the hair is very much real. I'm looking at my mirror. If you guys are wondering what I'm looking at. Look, there's a length difference and I don't wanna, should I, should I cut there some more? Yeah, cause, yeah, okay. So what I learned through video watching is that you brush the hair for, I'm just gonna burn again. You brush the hair for comb the hair forward towards your face and twist it this way. Here we go. I'm scared. a length difference which is why I'm cutting this fuck you lean in the comb I can't even talk right now. I'm just gonna twist it. I'm, I'm just gonna twist it. Bro, what did I just do? <laughs> okay, twisting good, twisting good, twisting good. It's not even, it's, it's, is it, is it even, it's not, it's not.
I swear I'm not a brat. Just <laughs> before and it was fine but I noticed the length difference in the hair of the actual girl and me so like this is definitely a throwback look that's bringing me to my peak it's brought me to my peak, to my pressure place. Is that a thing? Your pressure place? I'm actually shaking y'all. Not exactly the same, but you know, we're close enough. I'm not gonna panic because panic is not good. Y'all, I just want to say I'm sorry for how I reacted in this video. It was super unf unprof <laughs> unprofessional. And, I don't know, I honestly believe I overreacted. It was super unprofessional, and I was just kind of being a brat. But not really. I was just nervous and overthinking, and my anxiety got to me. But I called myself down in the end. So, in my head, I'm um, telling myself yeah. that I'm overreacting. <laughs> such a wuss. Oh, that part is lifting up. Okay, so we do have a little piece lifting up right here, so I'm gonna fix it. professional would actually break down over their hair not going right that's how you know i'm not a professional <laughs> that's how you know i'm not a professional <laughs> okay so i think this is i think this is the final look no it's not these bangs are way too curly I think this is the final look. Let me know down in the comments how well slash bad I did. I mean, I think I did pretty good despite the little mental breakdown we had in the middle. I think it looks pretty neat. I'm sorry, I'm trying to get all this hair off of me. But um, this is pretty much the end of the video. This is the look. I'm gonna take some pictures.
I'm gonna take some pictures. I'm sorry to keep filling with the hair, but I'm gonna take some pictures and I'm gonna edit this video and I'm gonna post it. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, this video was definitely a roller coaster. Roller, ro ro this video was definitely a roller roller coaster. Roller coaster. At the end, because your girl started panicking. Okay, and I think that's perfectly normal when you're dealing with a new wig. You mess up, you start panicking. Uh, but I think it turned out pretty well for my first time doing a hairstyle like this. Uh, I usually just like go with flat irons, curls, or crimps. I've never done a layered look by myself. Uh, with a little bit of help from my mom. Uh, I think I nailed this look, guys. I don't know. What do you think? Tell me down in the comments below if you want more content like this. Don't be afraid to let me know. I really appreciate you guys' support, and I hope you continue to do so, and I will continue to post more content. Um, thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and share with your family, friends, and, I don't know, share the video. <laughs> I'd really appreciate it. But, um, yeah, Merry Christmas, guys. Have a wonderful holiday. I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!